Rubin, and I'm the organizer of this Bioinformatics Miniconf. Uh, thank you all for coming. Uh, I'm really excited to be here, and want to thank uh, thank all of you for for coming, and thank the organizers for uh, for inviting us. Um, so this is a bit new. I'm used. I'm I sort of self-identify as a biologist more than anything else, and so this is my first time at any sort of conference like this. Um, I'm used to being the most computational person in a room full of biologists, and this is absolutely flipped on its head. Uh, but I'm having a great time so far, um, and I hope that you all have a great time today. So um, just by a little bit of background, so kind of how we got here. So I'm a, I'm a researcher at uh, the Walter and Eliza Hall Institute of Medical Research in Melbourne, and um, I gave a lecture. And this lecture, uh, and it was like a total research lecture for specialists in the field, but it was attended by uh, Russell Coker, who's in the audience. And he afterwards said, wow, that was really interesting. Why don't you come and talk to us at Winnix Users Victoria? And I said, okay, that sounds great. And I did that, and I gave uh, a sort of a more generally oriented lecture there. And um, it was a lot of fun, and it was a great audience. And my co-presenter that night uh, was Donna Benjamin, and she said, wow, that was really cool. Bioinformatics is great, and it's related to open source, so you should organize a mini-conf at LCA. And I said, what's LCA, and what's a mini-conf? And she told me what those things are, and uh, was very supportive, and, and here we are. So I just want to specifically thank uh, Russell and Donna for, for encouraging us and kind of making this, this whole thing possible, and otherwise, you know, we definitely wouldn't be here. Um, so just, just very generally, like why did I think it was appropriate for, for us to you know, come here as, as bioinformaticians who mostly interact with biologists to LCA? I, I, there's these three statements here which I think are, are not at all controversial. Um, although we often don't think of ourselves in this way, uh, we're, we're open source software developers. Um, and academic research is totally dependent on uh, free and open source software. Without uh, all of these sort of products, we wouldn't be able to do what we do. And uh, I think that these communities don't talk to each other enough. So that's why, that's why we're here today, is um, to kind of tell you about what we're doing and hear what you think about, about our work and, and maybe how we can do what we do better. And uh, so I'd also like to take a moment to thank our, our conference sponsor. So this mini conf is, is sponsored by VLSCI, the Victorian Life Sciences Computation Initiative. And, um, they were really instrumental in helping get all the speakers down here and, and help sort of put everything together for us. Um, and so if you want to learn more about bioinformatics, bioinformatics uh, you know, in Victoria as well as internationally, uh, I encourage you to go to their website. And again, um, thank you all for coming. And so with that, I, I, don't wanna I think I scheduled 10 minutes, but I don't wanna talk at you for 10 minutes. So, so without further ado, um, I'll introduce our first speaker, uh, Dr. Bernie Pope. He is a... Um, a researcher actually at VLSCI. I should say that despite the fact that VLSCI is sponsoring, that had no impact whatsoever on the selection of speakers. There are a lot of VLSCI speakers because there are a lot of people at VLSCI who are very, very good at what they do. Um, so Bernie is, uh, is a researcher at VLSCI and uh, is also a big fan of Haskell. So please, uh, please welcome him. Mm -hmm. Thanks. 